can't watch this. This video is sponsored by Casetify. So you just got yourself a shiny new iPhone 13, and of course you're gonna wanna keep it that way. So the first thing you're gonna be looking at is a solid case that will protect your hefty investment. Well, I have a couple of great options for you that will do just that and that will look cool doing it. Oh, and of course we'll put it to the test and drop that sucker from a serious height. Let's ramble. Hold up, place go well when I pull up. They all on me like a once. Hey, what's up guys? It's great to see you all again. And if you're new here, I'm Patrick, and this is why I ramble about tech and other stuff. So guys, if you've been to this channel before, you've seen me talk about Casetify. They've been kind enough to sponsor some of my videos before, and I'm always happy to work with them again because I think it's a dope company and they make good products. Now, before we move on to the actual products, let me explain why I think they're a dope company. What I appreciate about them is that they don't just produce the cheapest stuff and sell it at the highest possible price. They actually put a lot of thought into their products, not only from a design and protective point of view, but also in terms of their environmental impact and health and safety. Their new impact and ultra impact cases are made out of 65% recycled and plant-based materials. And they ship those cases in 100% recycled packaging, made with recycled paper and non-toxic soy ink. Yes, that's right, the actual beans. The cases are also 100% BPA free and 100% non-toxic and non-hazardous. And as a father, I can really appreciate that. I mean, kids will chew on anything they can get their hands on and our phones are always laying around. Now, I'm not saying you should let your kids use your phone as a chew toy, you shouldn't, but it's reassuring to know that these things are not toxic. Now, of course, we as adults are not in the habit of chewing on our phones. Well, maybe some of us, you know who you are. But these cases also protect our health because of a feature called Defensify, which is an antimicrobial coating that kills 99% of bacteria by preventing the growth of microbes and preventing bacteria from sticking to the surface in the first place. So kudos to Casetify on all of the above. Another reason why I appreciate Casetify is the fact that they are constantly coming up with new designs, including collaborations with well-known brands. So they can always bring us fresh new cases. And even if in those hundreds of designs, there isn't anything that tickles your fancy, you can go and customize your own case. Just pick a base design you like, pick any color you like, choose a font and add your own branding. Pretty awesome. Right, so let's have a look at these cases. When it comes to the Impact series, we have two variants. We have the Impact cases and we have the Ultra Impact cases. I think you can guess which one is which. The Impact cases are drop test approved to a height of 6.6 .6 feet, whereas the Ultra Impact cases can withstand drops from up to 9.8 feet. Now that's pretty damn high, but for the drop test today, I feel like pushing it a little higher to see what these cases are made of. Now in the last drop test we did on this channel, I actually strapped one of these bad boys to my drone and I dropped it from a crazy height. So I do have a certain amount of faith in these cases. You can go check out that video if you haven't seen it. I'll put a link at the end of this one. Now the cases I asked for have some pretty funky designs. I usually rock a leather Apple case on a day-to-day -day basis, but whenever I go and do something active or I wanna take my phone into the water, that Apple case is no good. Plus it's kind of boring looking. So when I switch to another case, I appreciate something more colorful. So all of these cases have what Casetify calls Chitec 2.0 technology, which is their plant-based impact absorbing material, which is engineered with a dual layer construction. The shock dispersing material is lined inside the case's bumper, protecting all four corners, but that doesn't mean the cases get overly bulky. In fact, the Ultra Impact case is Casetify's slimmest, most protective iPhone case at only 13 millimeters thin. Obviously, all the buttons are accessible and they feel nice and clicky. There's cutouts in all the right places. And I do really appreciate the signature Casetify ring around the camera bump. The cases are also nice and grippy and they have raised edges all around so you can toss it onto your table or your desk without having to worry about damaging the back or the screen or the table for that matter. If you do want that extra bit of protection, Casetify also makes these tempered glass screen protectors that go very well with the cases. All right, enough talk. Let's go drop this thing.
can't watch this. Well, as you can see, these things do what it says on the tin. My phone is fine. I may have shaved a few days off of my life from the anxiety, but there we go. By the way, also something cool to mention is that Casetify is running their Drop to Zero campaign, which they call the re program. If you're upgrading to the new iPhone 13, you probably have a bunch of old cases that don't fit lying around the house. Instead of tossing them out, you can actually send them back to Casetify through the re program. And not only are you recycling your phone case, but you'll also get a special discount for your new one. Casetify also accepts all phone cases. So even if they're not from their own brand, and those cases are then crushed up and used again in brand new Casetify crush cases that look a little bit like this. Pretty cool. But in any case, pun not intended, if you got a new iPhone or you're gonna get one, you should definitely look into the Casetify cases. Go to casetify.com slash Patrick Rambles and get 15% off your order. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, please give it one of these. It really does help the channel. Subscribe for more content. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one.